In this tutorial, I'll show you how to get started using Image Converter Plus. Once you install ICP, you'll find this icon on your desktop. Just double-click to open the interface where you can convert and customize your images. First, I'll open the Photos tab and import my images. I can add one image at a time from my hard drive, add a whole folder full of images at once, or just drag and drop images straight from the desktop. Now I'll go to the Profile tab and choose what to do with these images. I can customize them by adding operations like resize, crop, watermark, and more. Each operation includes special settings to fine-tune its effects. I can convert my images to any of these popular formats. I can save my converted images to a folder on my hard drive, upload them to an FTP server, send them by email, or even share them on a Picasso web album. I'll choose my hard drive. Now I can enter the path for the folder I'd like to use, pick a folder from the drop-down menu, or click on User Defined Path and browse to any folder I like. Finally. I can enter a file name for my converted images. Use this default code to keep the original file name with the new file type, or I can adapt the file name so I'll always know which is the original and which is the conversion. When I'm done, I click Start, and Image Converter Plus applies my operations to all the images I imported, converts them to the file format I chose, sends them to my destination, and gives them the file names I selected. It's easy. I can even convert images straight from the desktop. I'll just right-click on an image file to see a preview of the image. Now I click on Convert To and I can choose a profile, a whole set of operations. And again, I can send my images to a folder, an FTP server, an email address, or a web album. I just click on my destination and I'm done. ICP will convert and even upload my images in the background. Thanks for watching. To learn more, please visit www.imageconverterplus.com/video.